everyone, my name is Molly Van Hussen. I'm 25 years old and I am thrilled to be with you all. Oi. It's today in Spanish. You may be wondering where Catherine is. Well, let me tell you where she is. She's away. <laughs> so she asked me to be here with you all. Oi. <laughs> Uh, so that you know a little bit more about me. I work for the science department of bureaucracy. I am not at liberty to discuss what I do. You could ask me out for some coffee and I'll tell ya. Anyway, we're going to do a little question here so that you know who the heck I am. Uh, but this question is gonna be a little different because I haven't seen these questions. I haven't seen them at all. <laughs> Number one. You had to totally make out with either Gollum from Lord of the Rings or the Crust from Jurassic Park. Which would you choose? I would have to say the Crust from Jurassic Park. I really like his high jeans. I think he has a great cowboy hat and he's very knowledgeable with the Tyrannosaurus, Brachiosaurus, and Brontosaurus breeds. Number two, if you could live in any book, where would you live? I think this is a fantastic question. And you know what, children? Read your books. I would have to choose Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Either that or Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Who's with me? Can I hear ya? Number three. What song makes you want to get up and dance? What do you like on your pancakes? What don't I like on my pancakes? I like me on my pancakes. <laughs> but for real, uh, chocolate, blueberries, strawberries, boysenberries, raspberries, any type of berry, multi-berry, I like my pancakes smothered. If you went to the circus, what fun food would you want and why? Probably those little stick things with that cloud on it. At what age do most people have to start trimming their nose hair? Well, not to get personal, <laughs> I had to start when I was <coughs> 10, uh, but I feel like most start when they're, you know, at least five or six. Have you ever burped with your mouth closed and then blown it at someone? You haven't? Who doesn't do that? If you could give any advice to a 100 year old person, what would it be? My advice would be, congratulations, you made it this far. Oh! <laughs> anyway, um, hope you enjoy this segment. You know, Catherine told me about this little quote thing that she does. I'm not really into it, but because I comply with what people tell me to do all the time, I have no voice and I'm constantly being shut up in my mind, I'll do it. Molly's quote of the week is, Don't do it, they tell you. Don't do it. I hope you have a, a splendid week. It was really nice meeting y'all. You know, sometimes I just don't know where I was from. When you're constantly trying to be someone else, you go crazy. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Remember that Jesus loves you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>